Hey, what's up? So, um, I have decided that <clears throat> on Sunday, the 5th of August, 2018, for one whole entire week, I'm gonna be vegan. And I wanna do this just because I wanna see what happens to my body. Sorry for whispering, it's because my parents are asleep. I wanna see how I feel during this week and after this week and if anything changes. So, and also how much it's gonna cost me to be able to maintain this lifestyle for a week you know so that should be interesting especially because food here in Australia or in Sydney vegan food is quite expensive we'll see <laughs> should be fine um, I also have to do some research on what recipes I'm gonna try and make so I can eat home-cooked meals I also want to go out if I do go out I need to make sure that what I eat is vegan so <sighs> also right now I was literally just about to get a drink and the mother it's and he's drunk um and um i look at the back and it contains glucose and glucose i don't think is vegan oh wait huh. awesome all right well if i want to have this i guess i can but just for the sake and just to be sure i won't so it is night time and I probably shouldn't have it but I can actually sleep on drinks like this like it doesn't affect me much I'll just stick to my tea so <sighs> anyways so let's do this I'm gonna be vegan, vegan this week like that's kind of a big deal for me because I love to eat meat I'm a, I'm, I eat meat I eat fish I eat a lot of animal products I love cheese I'm a, oh, I love better cheese so much let's do this <laughs> went to Little Caesars because I was like oh maybe they have like a vegan option but I walked in and I'm like do you guys have anything vegan and they said no and I was like okay this is hard especially because at home I don't have much to eat already like I'm not gonna eat lettuce like I want to eat something that fills me up this isn't easy <laughs> I don't I don't know like <laughs> all right I'm just gonna go somewhere and buy some vegan stuff okay So this is vegan. feeling a bit just like, I don't know, I'm just feeling a bit shitty. I'm just not used to this. And it's just kind of the fact that I have to like watch everything I'm eating and a lot of the foods that exist has animal product things in it and it's just, yeah. So I'm just, I don't know how I feel at the end of the week. I can't even explain the amount of times that I've almost accidentally ordered something and thought, oh wait, I can't have that so I'm vegan <laughs> for this week. Well who knows, maybe I'll maybe I'll like it and then I'll just stay vegan. I really do like feta cheese. And a salad and a thick crucial. One 
sausage in each and just tomato sauce and mustard and I just feel like it's just not enough <laughs> I feel like I definitely did not eat enough today and I think I should go get like actual food with proper nutrients I literally am just like walking around the kitchen just trying to think like I have some things that I could put together but it's just like I'm being very picky and it, ugh, so I am day three in. Excuse the fucked up face that I have right now. I haven't eaten still. It's 2 p.m. I've just been on the computer editing, doing some things, and uh, so last night I felt I don't know what happened, but last night, where do I put this? Oh my god. Okay, so last night I didn't really eat much but i still ate a pretty filling meal i went to grilled and ate i'm gonna turn the music off fuck my life everything's like pissing me off everything's just kind of like ticking me off i don't know why but um i guess it's just i'm just frustrated at the fact that i'm so limited to so many things where i could just normally grab that and eat and then now it's just like i can't and i'm just not used to it so I honestly, I thought I was going to be okay, like it's just like whatever, it's just no meat, no animal product, no nothing, animals. But um, <laughs> yeah, no, it's um definitely affecting me in some weird way, I guess, which is really weird and it's crazy to even say that and think that it's even happening to me because like, <clears throat> it's just really different. Like I'm going like straight in cold turkey, like absolutely nothing, no animal product. You know and there are just so many things like in the ingredients it says that it contains milk or or dairy or, or eggs or whatever so it's just like oh fuck I can't have that you know so it's just um anyway so so right now I'm just gonna make my first big meal there's I'm just gonna have bread with uh, just a vegan sausage and tomato sauce because that's vegan right um is it healthy probably not but I just need to have something quick because I have work soon again. Um, and yeah. But it's just crazy. Like, I'm, I'm just really amazed at how I, it's even affecting me, I guess. I don't know. Last night after work at 12 at midnight, um, or past 12, I went to McDonald's. I was hungry. I was so close to accidentally ordering um, just like a cheeseburger or something. Then I was like, oh, wait, I can't. So I was like, okay, so what can I eat that's vegan? Fries. So I got two large fries and just tomato sauce and I got mustard. I don't know if mustard has animal product in there. I may have fucked up there, but the mustard was so nice. So I made it a lot better. But then after the chips, I felt sick. Like my stomach was in so much pain. Even right now, I feel like really shitty. I just feel heavy. I just don't feel good. That might be also why I'm having like, sh like I'm in a shitty mood. I don't know. Yeah, I, I kind of regret having a too large packet of chips, but I was literally starving because I didn't. All I had was like four bananas and two mandarins on my work break. My 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 yeah, on my break at work. And then before that, I had what like a a vegan burger with a small side of like sweet potato fries and just water and then earlier I don't even know what I, I didn't think I had anything else so yeah <laughs> so I'm just gonna make what I kind of made the other day I didn't show it because I ate it too quick because I was fucking hungry I just gonna be fucked I just I wanted to eat so so basically I um got this by the way vegan meat is not cheap um yeah that's not a cheap um, okay, is it recording? Please be recording. Yes, it is. My camera is dying. Fuck! So, oh, also, I was just on the computer for all this time, just making or like learning as I as I do on my free time. And just I made this like it's not a song, but it's it is, but it's not because it's not finished. But I made it. <laughs> um, it was really random. Yeah. So I just downloaded it on my phone. So I'll show you guys while I do this. I don't know if it's... Quality isn't that good because obviously it's not like that great or like master. It's very progressive. I'm gonna fix the heat pot, seriously. 
But yeah, anyways. <laughs> I just did that. I just wanted to hear it on my phone. Um, anyway, so, um, yeah, so basically I got this. This was like $7, six, seven dollars. Um, they're just veggie, veggie sausages. Um, so I'm just gonna make that. So let's, I was gonna use that pan, but I think my mom used it for chicken, so can't use that. So you might be thinking, what the fuck? <laughs> um, basically what happened, uh, the actual induction, electrical kitchen um, stopped working. So we have this alternative until we get a new one. Hopefully sometime soon because it's really shit not having an actual, fuck. Oh my God. As you can tell, you know, sometimes we struggle. Oh my God. It's not, it's not going down. Oh my god! All right, let's just work with that. Okay, so I'm just gonna add, I'm just gonna add olive oil. I use olive oil. I would use coconut, but I feel like that would be for like other stuff. Oh my god, that's a lot. Okay, it's fine. I'm gonna make this work. It's fine. Um, so yeah. So basically, yeah, I just put these in and just, I might just cook all of them, you know? Yeah. Fuck okay. it. I'm cooking them all. Okay. That really quick. Just two, three, four. You might be thinking, that's a lot of oil. Yeah, I know. Um, I don't normally use this much oil, but I realize that it burns if I don't use this much oil. I don't know. I don't like it when it's like totally burnt. You know, like, see, that's... Let's see if this is vegan. This is suitable for vegetarians and vegans. Oh, sick. Please my game. Oh, that's not good. Alright, so. When I got back, I just ate the two sausages that you saw me cook earlier with bread, mustard, and ketchup. And I was like, I need more food. So I went to the shops last minute. I got a chicken. So I got some bananas. I got vegan eggs. I've been, I've seen this product on the shelf for a while and I've been wanting to try it. And when I had that burger, when I ate out at Grilled, they used a vegan mayonnaise and it tasted really nice. I'm excited to try this. Some mandarin. I got some juice when I feel like drinking something sweet. I got this <laughs> for when I'm like editing properly this video. I'm gonna need some energy or when I'm doing something with music because I got a olive green yummies dairy free gluten free dip. I love Chris's, the brand is Chris, Chris's um, dips. The, the, the one that has three different um, olives, it's an olive blend. It's so nice, but it has milk in it. So, for egg, I'm gonna get some avocado. Sweet potato, so I can probably make sweet potato fries or something, bake it, fry it, whatever. I've got vegan and vegetarian friendly crackers. This, this was on special. Um, it's just a sweet and sour stir fry sauce. It said it's great for chicken, pork, or tofu, and this is also um, vegan. Pretty sure it's vegan. I read it. It's just got um, soybeans and wheat. I have tofu that expired back on the 12th of July and it's like 8th of August um, right now. By it looks fine. It said best before the 12th of July, but it didn't say expired on. Do you know what I mean? It's best before then, but if you eat it after, it should be fine. So hopefully that's fine to eat. <laughs> So yeah, this is my, um, the protein, the meat that I'll get out of this will be the tofu. Fingers crossed it's fine, should be fine. But this video is probably not going to be interesting at all or no one's going to give a shit, but I don't know. I just thought it'd be, I've always wanted to try it. Just try it. Oh yeah, I'm trying it. Mm, so nice and like sour and juicy. I love mandarins. I can literally eat 10 in one sitting. Maybe even more. 
Firefoxek. I have to do everything manually. Fuck. Hi. <laughs> Are you recording? Yeah, yeah. Am I recording? Yeah, I'm, I'm English and I'm on camera, yeah. Alright, let's do this. You squint at the camera? Because <laughs> <laughs> I'm trying to concentrate. Squint All right. Out. So, right now, as I speak. Oh, yeah, by the way, maybe I should introduce you, right? No. No? <laughs> The man who introduction. <laughs> no, okay, so yeah. I'm here with Matthew right now. We're just having we just had Mac is at two o'clock in the morning. Yeah. Um anyways, so I wanna tell you let me try to zoom it into you, not me, because I'm not important for this shot. Mm hmm Okay. <laughs> so Yeah. I Uh huh. I am vegan. Sick. Cool. <laughs> for how long? I mean, like, just, how long have you been vegan? Not just like, for a week. <laughs> it's like a phase. I'm doing it just for a week. No, no, no. I'm doing it just for a week. You're doing... What do you mean? I'm just doing it for a week. You're just going vegan for a week? Just for a week. It's not a challenge. Is this like a challenge? <laughs> this is a challenge. Yes. For me, it's a challenge. Yeah. I don't make go... Sorry. No. Go. What? What? I was going to say veg over one year. Big fucking commitment. <laughs> it is, isn't it? I don't. Uh, I feel like this lifestyle is maintainable. Like I can do it, right? Yeah, just like. I just don't want. To. <laughs> you know, my my best mates. Mm -hmm. <laughs> my best mates' fiance is like lactose intolerant, and she can't eat anything with gluten. Right. So a lot of what she eats, like basically vegan anyway because yeah. you know she's limited in what she can eat due to yeah. those like dietary yeah. restrictions but um yeah it costs more money at most places yeah <laughs> no is that a zoom yeah. so like <laughs> zooming the <laughs> lens you just move I look the camera. Who it is. like that high <laughs> you can't just like eat you know everything that you normally eat you have to like supplement all that um stuff that you're not getting yeah. through other foods yeah you gotta change your diet. Completely. And I'm still, I, it's not like I did a big amount of research on like what to eat specifically to like yeah. do a complete. Maybe you've already broken your challenge, you just don't know it. The tiniest of things can like. Be, oh, I know. Yeah. I fucking know. Look at me just being OCD, like, because that's so neat. Ignores me. Okay. Anyways. <laughs> mm. So yeah, but yeah, I have one more day left, and I don't know how I'm gonna. Do. You talk as if like you're on like death row, like oh, I have a day left, you know. Like I, w I want to get chocolate, but I can only get the ninety percent just dark chocolate. Yeah. Because the others all have. Obviously, dairy chocolate isn't exactly appropriate. I know. No. <laughs> so I'm back, and it's already been like a week or two since I've done this, and the reason I didn't film, I didn't post this until like right now when you're seeing this is because just hectic things happening plus with the trip coming up and stuff um that i have in mind so i'm just gonna film this outro right now to update what happened so basically i went vegan for a week i went vegan for a week and it was really an experience um i did it because i wanted to see what it was like to have a a restricting be a little bit restricted from what majority of population eat which is meat which is anything you really want unless you're allergic to something but you know what I mean so I wanted to see what it was like and I wanted to see how I felt and how my body reacted and if I felt any better like mentally spiritually physically and <clears throat> my result from it was actually not what I expected but at the same time I have to remember that I didn't do this challenge very well in a sense where I did not cook my meals every day I didn't eat the healthiest things every day I went I remember I, I couldn't I was really really hungry at night and I couldn't go home um, when everyone was asleep and make something so I had to just think of something last minute just go to McDonald's get chips because that's the only vegan thing that I could get and I felt really sick 
when I woke up in the morning. Even at night, it was hard to sleep on a full stomach of just fried chips because it was just so heavy. And then I woke up and I still, still felt full and really bloated and I just felt gross for the entire day. And I was moody and, you know, obviously it doesn't help. Because of that, I think that's why I felt bloated throughout the week and I just didn't feel physically very well. Um, other things is like I learned so much about like food and if you look at their ingredients and you do research about it a lot of products have animal products inside or ingredients sorry and um, yeah it's pretty interesting like a lot of the food that I eat without even knowing sometimes has like animal ingredients in there like somewhere um, but yeah that was that was really interesting um, a lot of my friends some knew some didn't and they were just kind of like, why would you do this? But it really was just a self-experimentation. I just wanted to see what it was like and blah, 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 blah. And I thought it was really cool. So yeah, I don't know. I think it was really cool. Um, would I do it again? Yes, I would do it again. Not anytime soon, but probably in the future in a couple months or something um, where I am definitely going to make sure I make my recipes all vegan and make homemade meals and it's a good experiment and it actually counts but um, from this experience it didn't really make me want to really go vegan because I do enjoy having the freedom to eat whatever I want and it, that's just me though you know plus I do like I do like animal products like I'm not I'm not gonna get too in depth with that because I don't want to like have people like hate on me or anything for that because I totally respect vegans if not even more now because I know even back when I didn't do this but I always knew that vegans like the way they eat is like amazingly clean and it's just so healthy and I know it's great um, and you really have to like be committed to it but I just for me personally I just can't commit to it it's just not for me it's not for everybody um, but you know I still love their food though. A lot of like their um, takeout food or like restaurant food is, there's not much on the menu. I noticed that too, but um, a lot of it tastes really nice. So I will, I will give them that. Um, but yeah, it's good experiment. And um, yeah, if you want to see more videos where I do things like this, where I just like try random things out, uh, just give this video likes up and comment or suggest something. Don't forget to subscribe um, and yeah. <laughs> also, let me know if you guys like this backdrop because um, I got this a while ago. This is like the first time I'm properly using it and yeah, with like lighting and stuff, but it's pretty cool. Can you like make a tutorial here? Like, hey guys, blah, blah.